Hey, what is going on, everybody? It is me, Clear Customs, and today I am back for another custom LEGO minifigure showcase video. And I know it has been a super long time since I've actually done a legitimate showcase. It's all just been, you know, update style videos. But I figured I would get into it with two new awesome figures Minifig Scale Bebop and Rocksteady. Just super awesome characters that I, you know, man, it. Th watching that animated series really, wow. I'm thinking of sometime making big figs of these guys, but for now, this is why I have, because I'm a little excited for Team NT2, but anyways guys, let's go ahead and take a close up look. Alright, I thought I would start off with um, Bebop, and I think he turned out just awesome. Uh, first of all, just his overall color I think looks super, super awesome. I like how I, I did sculpt the mohawk, but let me get into all of it in detail here. Um... So just starting out, the mohawk is custom sculpted with green stuff. Here, I'll turn him to show you. Um, it's a purple mohawk, obviously. I shaved off part of the top of the head as well. There's nothing on the back. I didn't see anything to put on the back. Um, I have his uh, red vest, whole whole thing right there. His sunglasses, I think, turned out really awesome as well. Because um, everything on this figure, n even everything but the hands, was my... Uh, Pin and even the base colors for the legs, the head, the torso, the arms, the mohawk, the shoes, I think, are the best part of this figure. And as I give you guys a quick 360 of how those shoes turned out, I'm just really loving them and uh, how they turned out. So, oh, yeah, I, I don't really care about the bottom side, but in the back doesn't really have too much on it. Um, now, a weapon that I can give him is this APOC SMG. Um, because I figure that he doesn't really need a weapon, except they do use sci-fi weapons, and oh my gosh, piece of hair. So that is the Alright, here we have Rocksteady, who is always my personal favorite. Um, and now one thing you will see, he does not have a horn, unfortunately. That's one thing I'd like to hit if I ever make a big fig. Sorry if you hear any background noise. Now I saw every image, he has a sword attached onto his back. Um, but I wasn't gonna glue a huge sword like this on, and, uh, so yeah, let me take off the sword, and it was brown, uh, so obviously, you know, it was a kid's show. Um, I love how the legs turned out, you know, you got the pockets on there. Uh, the torso is easily my favorite part, though, just really love how the whole torso turned out, got the little grenade on there, the straps going both ways, um, you turn them on the back, it continues, so, Rocksteady's definitely the more simple figure, so let's wrap up the showcase. Alright guys, well that is it. Go ahead and comment below which one of these two figures you like better, Bebop or Rocksteady. Personally, my favorite is uh, Bebop. And so yeah, comment down below also if you want to see the big figure variants of these guys because I really hope to be able to do that soon. And anyways guys, I will see you all in the next video.